the vase before and I really liked it. This is the vase that I made last time and I wanted to make another one. This one was with green and gold. It was clear with, these are the green beads that they had in there and then gold leaf paper. And I like how this turned out. I wanted to do another one. So I'm gonna set this to the side. So what I've done is have a little bit of chunky glitter and then I have some gold stars. And all I'm gonna do is, uh, let me try to get up, I'm stuck. So I'm gonna mix these together. Probably don't need all the gold stars, just enough. I'm gonna pour some of my resin. I'm gonna mix clear first and I'm gonna let I'm going to go in and add some crystals to this. Just going to kind of pump it up. See what it does to it. can not hurt. These are the crystals. Looks like little diamond beads. Okay guys, it has been four hours, and as you can see, it's not quite completely set, but it's enough so I can start molding my bowl. What do you guys think so far? It's pretty. Isn't that pretty? This is the bowl I'm going to use. I'm just going to sit on top. molded to the edges of the bowl. And it doesn't matter how it sticks out, just as long as it's 
mold it like a bowl. Continue to set up for 24 hours. So this is what it looks like. Okay. I'll see you guys back here in 24 hours. Okay, guys, welcome back to my channel. So I wanted to show you my bowl. And this is what it looks like. Oh, it's so gorgeous. I like it. I like the purple dye in there. So it looks like little flowers. What do you guys think? As you can see the rim, the edges with the gold leaf. And then I put some um, crystals, some di uh, not diamond, but um, beads. Some, um, what do you call those? Um, diamond uh, crystals. And this is what it looks like. And I want to kind of jazz it up a little bit to the rim. So I got a little bit of glue that's sort of making a mess right here. So what I'm going to do is kind of put a little bit of glue. Actually, let And anything that falls on this, I'll get it up. Okay. Oh, it's looking really good. Guys, make sure you thumb up my video. Hit that like button. Leave comments. Okay. I'm going to continue just to add glitter to the rim. Ooh, this is looking so, so good. And I like making these. I didn't know when I turned the camera off and I was, you know, had it draped on top of the bowl. Then I was thinking, oh, you know what? What if I made it into a vase instead of a bowl? But then I was like, you know what? I keep it as a bowl and kind of go with it. So I'm glad I kept it as a bowl. I'm glad I trust my instincts and kept it as a bowl. look at it this is what it looks like with the rim I almost dropped it I'm gonna let it sit up for a little bit and then I'll come back and show you guys the end result the finished result welcome back to my channel so I wanted to show you the finished result of my bowl isn't it gorgeous you can see the purple dye in there I wanted it to look like flowers and I might go back in and do a little bit more embellishment but I wanted you to see what it looks like because that's the inside and this is glitter that I put around the edges what do you guys think I hope you guys like this I had a really great time making this. So this is really, really simple. You, you just mix your resin, add uh, any tint color that you want, and then just pour it flat on the surface. Let it sit for about three to four hours. Um, 
Four hours probably will work better. Three hours, it depends on how thin it is. If it's really thin, you don't have to go the full four hours. But if it's a little bit thicker, you want to go the full four hours because when you drape it over anything, a bowl, a vase, a cup, or anything, if it's not completely set and if it's a little bit thick, it'll kind of pull. And it'll still hold together. It'll just pull a little bit further than what you want it to go. So this one I draped and I let it sit for four hours. And so that's why it still looks good. That's why it doesn't look like it's any pieces like pulling or hanging out. But this is what it looks like, guys. I really hope you enjoyed this video. I enjoyed making it. Guys, please thumbs up this video. Um, leave a comment. And um, subscribe to my channel, Rose J Creates. And then check me out on Instagram. I'm also on Instagram as Rose J Creates. And then I also am offering membership. So if you would like to become a family member, I would love to have you. And so this is my resin bowl. Thank you guys for tuning in to Rose J Creates. Hope you like this video. Bye.